Hello guys, in this video we will discuss about reverse lookup function. Our task here we need to find employee ID and employee name. As you know that there is a limitation in VLOOKUP function. We can only find values from left to right. If you want to learn about VLOOKUP function, link is mentioned in the description. In our current scenario, employee ID and employee name on the left side of national ID. So we will use the reverse lookup function. Before I start my video further, subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon to get my all future videos notification. In the data table, you can see employee ID, employee name, national ID and basic salary. So what is our requirement? Our requirement is that we have national ID. On the basis of national ID, we need to look up employee ID and employee name. For reverse lookup, I will use choose function inside VLOOKUP function. So firstly, I need to look up employee ID. So I will use equal VLOOKUP bracket. Then I will select the lookup value that is national ID comma. The second criteria is table array. So instead of select the table, I will use choose function. Bracket. Then I will use curly bracket. Now I will enter 1. Which is the column reference number of my first criteria that is national ID. Comma. I will enter 2 now. Which is the second column reference of employee id curly bracket close then comma now i will select the first column which is national id then comma now i will select the second column which is employee id and bracket close then comma now i will give the column index number which is 2 comma now i will give the exact match so i will write it here false and bracket close and press enter when i press enter you can see i got the employee id 18008 so if you go to this national id which is double three seven double two five six one two hundred and here you can find in this data table and you can see that employee id is one eight zero zero eight if i double click this formula you can see that i have used two numbers in choose function one and two one number is always represent the lookup value column which is national id column and two number is always represent that column in which we need to find the data and that is employee id column so our next requirement is that we need to find employee name so here we will again use the reverse lookup which is equal we look up bracket lookup values national id comma so instead of table array we will use choose function choose bracket then we will use curly bracket and here i will mention one that is lookup uh, value column co comma two that is uh, employee name column now so curly bracket close comma now i will select the column the first column is national ID column, comma, and second column is employee name column. Again, bracket close, then comma. Now column index number is 2, comma. So we need to exactly match our value. So I will write it here false and bracket close, press enter. When I press enter, you can see the employee name is Frederick here. So if I go back on this employee ID, 
and national id you can see this is our national id and employee name is frederick and employee id is 18008 so if i change the employee id here for example this one you can see employee id is 18011 and employee name is alfred so if we go back on database on this national id here you can see this is our national id and employee name is alfred and employee id is same 18011 hopefully guys you like this video if you have any question about this function you can ask me in the comments thank you so much